Olympic champion Helen Marul has hit a beautiful foot sweep on Jenna Burkett this past weekend at the U.S. Olympic Trials, pinned her to secure her spot for Tokyo Olympics, and it was beautiful. This is not the first time that she hit it. She hit it at the 2018 World Championships. However, it was a little bit different. Even though they're quite similar, they're also very different, and I'm going to break down both of them for you. At the World Championships, just a pass by foot sweep. This is the foot sweep that Helen Marulis hit in the 2018 World Championship gold medal match against Tunisia's Mawa Amri. Now, Helen did this from an over collar tie pass by position, meaning it, it appeared as though she was going to rip this off and clear it off, but she was setting up her foot sweep the whole time. She has some pressure weight down going on that head, and then she comes up, grabs her wrist as if she's passing it by. But in this whole process, she's she's pulling and trying to get Omri to back out of here. And what that will do is put weight on this back foot. Helen took a big step, toe going to the far side so she can get that rotation with her kick. She pushed the head away like this. And that put a lot of weight on that back leg and made this leg really, really light. Over call a tie, the pass by position, coming up to the wrist. When she jumps in, she's sort of pushing that head away and then pulling it. So Amri ends up being basically in front of Marulis, and that makes that leg really light and just really easy to sort of sweep out. When this peels off, you sort of want to redirect the opponent so they land behind. All right, you don't want to land in front, you want them to land behind. So when I come here and sweep this leg out and elevate, I can land right on top and follow all the way down. Gonna have to have one of her better matches. Cat is ready to wrestle. So she's nice. You can see here Helen employs the same setup over collar tie. However, when Helen grabbed the wrist, Jenna retreated her collar tie out. It was actually very smart for Jenna to react this way. However, she squared up too hard and it put all her weight on that right foot and made that front foot very light giving Helen that angle with the foot hooked already. Check out how far Helen forces Jenna to square up and put all her weight on that right foot. With all that weight on Jenna's back foot and Helen's angle, she already has the leg hooked and elevates very easily. She knee picks here, which she probably doesn't need to do, but it's just another bonus here to secure the takedown. Even with the knee pick, notice Helen's driving all of Jenna's weight towards her head. That's because she still has that over collar tie and is following her all the way to the mat.